Howdy guys, Yemi here. Got a brand new video for you today. I do apologize, I've been away from my YouTube videos lately. But I got a lot coming up these uh, next few weeks for sure. I went out today and I picked up the brand new Nintendo Switch Lite. I currently own the newest Nintendo Switch that was refreshed with the new uh, processor that gives it the extra battery life. Um, so I'm not sure which one of these I will be keeping based off of my usage and um, I'm, I'm not too sure. I, I want to play it mostly mobily. Uh, I don't, I think if, if I'm going to play something docked, I'll play um, a console that can run games more powerful such as a PlayStation or an Xbox. Uh, I, I have tried playing Fortnite on the Switch and I've not been a fan of it. Um, it's just not as great as when you play it on an Xbox or a PlayStation. So the better life though it, it is great when I play it handheld. Uh, I've not gone below 50% and this is just me playing extended hours. Uh, Fortnite, Mario Kart, um, I have Fortnite free, so I don't have it, but I've been playing a lot of Mario Tennis and Mario Kart. Great games. Um, you guys make sure if you guys have me yet on uh, Nintendo, my username is, my Nintendo online ID is Yimmy. Um, if you guys want to get smoked in Mario Kart or Mario Tennis, if you guys have it, make sure you comment below what you're uh, in, the, in the comments. Let Drop your, your Nintendo online username. Um, as long as uh, if Fortnite I'll be playing if up when I'm on console on PC not so much on this but I did want to I am going to be doing an unboxing of the Switch Lite this is already unboxed so I just kind of want to compare a little bit um, for you guys to see how small the box is as you can see it's a bit significantly um, a small box there's no dock no controller attachment it's gonna be just a, a really you know general price a lot smaller than um, I know the screen's already smaller battery life is supposed to be about the same um, so here it is all right guys here's the box I did get the uh, so this is the Nintendo switch Lite. I did purchase it for $199, no special deal, nothing. Uh, just released today. I'm gonna go ahead and unbox it for you guys. And then we're gonna compare it to my regular Nintendo Switch. And then also guys, I didn't mention, if you guys would please like and subscribe, I will be pumping out more content here pretty soon. I do apologize for being away, but we got the content coming. I got an iPhone versus iPhone 11 Pro versus the Note 10 comparison as well. I have to make that change back to the iPhone, but we'll save that for the, the video. Here it is. I'm about to pull it out of the box. This is an exciting moment. I'm really excited to open this because I do love Nintendo products. It's like when I was a kid and I got my Game Boy Color. So. First, the first first impression is that I can see from here is that the yellow looks more like a pastel um, yellow. Not so it's not a bright neon yellow as I would expect. That's what it looks like right here. Let's continue with what's in the box before I um, here uh, paperwork safety whatever. It's not really important and the power brick which is almost everyone all the other videos I've seen is the exact same size and everything identical to what the one you get with the regular switch so you could if you have another switch you can use the same uh, same charger it's the same size it's not gonna affect you any differently so I'm gonna leave that in there so that's a relatively easy uh, unboxing um, that's all that it came in here I'll show you guys again the box nothing else is in there um, let's go ahead and take it out of the plastic and compare it to the regular $300 Nintendo Switch. I will say this is, 
this feels really good in the hand. It is very light. Um, it does feel very light. It feels good. The screen actually doesn't look too small. Um, I do like the, the D-pad instead of the uh, individual buttons like it is over here. This D-pad feels good. Clicky. I mean, it just feels really solid and well built, to be honest here. Um, let's see if it starts any different than the regular switch. Actually, let me move this out of the way um, beforehand. But as you can see, it feels solid, nice and light. Actually, before I turn it on, let's compare it to my regular Nintendo Switch, which is a little dirty. Let's wipe it off. When you play with your baby and your baby's touching all over the screen, it makes it hard. So actually, let's let's kind of compare them. So, I mean, it's about a Joy-Con longer. Um, can we stack it on top of each other? It's a little bit shorter. Let's see another angle right here. Boom. Sideways, it's also shorter. It's not as wide. Yeah, it's, uh, it's really small actually compared to it. Uh, the actual screen though, the bezel's not as big, at least the black border, um, as you can see. I mean, it is, a, it is a noticeable difference. You're gonna, you can tell definitely, but I think for the portability that you're getting out of it, it's gonna be a good deal. So let's go ahead and power this bad boy up for the first time. Ooh. I do apologize if there is any blur, but I hope it looks good. Let's see. Hopefully it has volume. Oh, nice. So you're gonna have to go through the setup. Um, I might finish this for, for later, but I think I could do videos uh, in the future comparing my, my performance then because I don't wanna go through the setup right now um, but I did want to do my, my first my unboxing impressions, first impressions, and in comparison to the regular Switch. Thanks again, guys, for joining me watching the video on the uh, comparison for the Nintendo Switch Lite and regular. Hopefully they come out with the Pro version sometime by the end of this year to uh, middle of the, the next year, 2020. I was looking forward for a Pro version. Uh, didn't look like we got it this year. They gave us something less pro, but more mobile. Um, you know, Nintendo's, they do a great job with with building consoles, except for the Wii U. The Wii U was, <laughs> Wii U was probably the biggest failure in the history of video games, outside of the, the Dreamcast. But um, So hopefully next time I do a Nintendo unboxing video, it will be... I got it, I got it backwards. Next time we do a uh, Nintendo unboxing, it'll be the, the, I'll have the Switch Lite, the Switch, and then it'll be the Switch Pro. Um, that hopefully won't be more than 400 bucks. And hopefully that'll bring 1080, or at least a, a less bezel for, for the screen, and maybe a, a 4K definition when you're playing docked. Um, you know, something, something more with better performance next time. Um, thank you guys for, for watching, for joining me. Please like and subscribe if you haven't so you could be notified. Uh, turn on your notifications for future upcoming videos. Like I mentioned, I do have a um, My 11 Pro versus the Note 10 Plus comparison coming up. Um, but for now, you know, I will be playing a little bit of Mario Kart, Mario Tennis, and Fortnite on here just to see how it goes. So if you guys see me, like I said, drop your Nintendo online ID in the comments. And uh, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thank you.